This week is severe weather preparedness week and all week our own Laura Smith is breaking down the weather hazards which you should know about and how to prepare too. So Laura, I know today you were focusing on tornadoes and the difference between a watch and a warning. Yeah, this is so important. When a tornado watch is issued, this basically means you need to get prepared, review that severe weather plan that you have and know where you should go to take shelter. A watch basically means that the ingredients are there favorable for tornadoes to form. Now a tornado means take action and get to your safe spot because this means a tornado has likely been spotted on radar. You want to put as many walls between you and the outside. And once you're in your storm shelter, get down to protect yourself from flying debris. That's the number one thing to remember. Inside, interior room, lowest floor, get down. So find that spot today if you don't know where that is. Tornadoes can happen any time of the year at any time of day or night. Just last month, a deadly tornado ripped through Brunswick County in the middle of the night. Only 28% of tornadoes occur at night, but account for 81% of deaths. So it is crucial to have something to alert you, a phone, a NOAA weather radio. Wednesday, the statewide tornado drills will occur around 930. I know schools and government buildings will be taking place and practicing their emergency plans, Bill Ray. Yeah, I remember going out to several schools when they do yeah. that, and it's a very, very well done. And the, uh, Nick, who you talked to there, yeah. he came out. I was out with him when he went to a school and, and, and talked to the students and everything and talked about the importance of being ready aware. I mean, practicing now, and I always tell kids when we go out, yep. have you talked to your parents about this? Have you asked your mom and dad? Where do we go if there's a tornado? Make sure mom and dad know that so they can help out the family. Even at work, you know, because it could happen when you're at a different building that you're not aware of. True, so. true. Stay away from windows, right? Tomorrow, Stay Nick will, t will talk with us about lightning. So he's going to be our star this week, Bill. All right. <laughs>